Hi, this is Lavinia at Equipoise Enlightened Exercise, and I am going to go through some of the footwork today that we did in our Tango Toning and Technique class on Monday. This footwork is actually wonderful no matter what kind of dance you do. And I used it myself. At one point, I had uh, broken my fifth metatarsal when I was dancing in New York at the Met Opera. And I had an audition in six weeks, and I did this every day when I couldn't even take class. And in the sixth week after, I put on point shoes, went to the audition, and got in. So it's phenomenal for keeping the feet very strong and for sensitizing the feet for proprioception. So you're going to lie down on the floor or on a mat in constructive rest position. And the important thing is that you see my foot, so if you don't see my head, it's not important. You want to bring your foot uh, and leg up at about 90 degrees. The knee has to be bent, and the foot has to be very, very dorsiflected. This does not count, all right? This is just a phase we go through. But uh, you might try, if you can balance a block or a piece of paper on your foot, then you have the sufficient amount of dorsiflexion to begin the exercise. And the exercise begins in this position and you're going to curl the toes, fan them out. And again, curl the toes like a monkey around a pencil and fan them out. And curl the toes, fan them out. Really make sure, I'm gonna show you, that the pinky toe moves away from the rest of the toes. Four times, curl the toes, fan them out, and one more time. Curl the toes, fan them out. You're really working these muscles here in the front of the shin. Now we're going to point the foot, articulating through the ball of the foot, and then curling the toes down, and then lifting the toes, and pulling the ball of the foot back as flat as possible. We do that four times. Ball of the foot and point, and lift the toes and pull the forefoot back ball of the foot and point, and lift the toes and pull the forefoot back, ball of the foot, point, lift the toes and pull the forefoot back. Then we're gonna curl the toes, sickling the foot towards the center line, and fan the toes away. Again, continue to dorsiflect that foot and ankle. Curl the toes and fan. Now reverse, curl out, fan in, curl out, fan in, and now we do four very articulated circles. Notice how I'm using all the toes, and four, reverse the circle. This is like using flamenco hands, so very differentiated toes, and four, and then relax and rest your foot down. I'm going to go through the whole thing on the other foot without stopping. So flat foot to the sky, the leg is parallel, curl the toes and fan them out. Curl the toes and fan them out. Curl the toes, fan them out. Curl the toes, fan them out. Point ball of the foot, toes, and lift the toes and flex. Ball of the foot and point, and lift the toes, spread them, and flex. Ball of the foot, point, toes, and flex. Ball of the foot, point, toes, and flex. Curls sickled in, fan winged out. Curls sickled in, fan winged out. Curl winged out, fan sickled in. Keep the foot dorsiflected, curl winged out. Fan sickled in, four circles, one and two. Articulating the toes, three and four. Reverse, one and two and three and four. And that concludes the exercise. Try this every day for a couple of weeks and see how your dancing improves.